We're doing it again with Mr. David Ball, huh? Yeah. Yeah. David B. Bot Ball is what I call him, yeah. We got Mr. Stephen Sweden from Montgomery, Texas. Yeah, he's going to open the show here a little while. So I uh, got to hang out with Steve with Mark Chestnut about two or three months back. Man, he stole the show, buddy. I guarantee it. Hey, I got to thank a couple of folks right quick. First of all, Eddie and Sherry. Or should I say Sherry and Eddie? Yeah. yeah. There you go. Courthouse Wilson Stop Cafe right here for opening up the doors this fine Sunday afternoon. Hey, also, I got to thank my buddy Phil Smith with Smith Properties right back there. And Burton Properties, they are uh, one of the big sponsors here today. I got to thank Brother Bill. And uh, let's see, uh, Brother Bebop Ricky over here, uh, my bud, right here. With all weather, AC and heating. Yeah, stepped up to the plate for us. More on sales. Uh, if you guys need some AC work done, I tell you what, this guy can do it. No overtime charges. All you got to do is call Rick. And all weather. Yep, got it going on. Yeah. Hey, also, uh, Miss Penny, uh, she writes in the Damn Good Times paper, right? All right. And you got an article in there this week, right? All right. Pick one up. I think we got them out the front door right there. So uh, y'all keep it right here. And, hey, we're going we're gonna to be doing some more shows here up and down the road, so uh, get ready. And uh, we're talking to some different guys and different entertainers. This guy, I'll tell you what, if you get a chance to see Stephen Sweden and his band, do it because this guy is awesome. He's local and he's around town all the time. He plays a bus with all up and down the road. Uh, and you're going to enjoy Stephen Sweden. He's from Montgomery, Texas. So uh, we're proud to have him. He's playing the place over here all the time. So but get ready. Enjoy your catfish. And uh, we're going to have some good entertainment coming up. And uh, got rocking the guys here from Royal Hills. Thank you coming out. Good guys. Good place to hang out, huh? We hang out there all the time, don't we? <laughs> Got a fine, fine place over uh, by, the, by the golf course there. So go to be sure to check them out. And again, I got to thank my boys, Ricky and All Weather, AC and Heating, and More On Sales, and the Holiday Inn Express, where country music stays. Right here in town. David, David uh, uh, he, he pays his bill every now and then. They let him stay there every now and then. Hey, be sure to tip the waitresses, okay? Because they are taking care of you, and they're taking good care of you. So be sure to take care of them. And again, thanks for coming out to the courthouse. We'll stop. Cafe. Got music coming up just a little bit. Yep. Stephen Sweden. How you doing, buddy? Doing pretty good. I'm still well, coming. It's a pleasure well, being out here. Yeah. You like this place, huh? Very, very comfortable home. Not nervous at all. There you go. Awesome. You got mom over there. She said, where, was, where did you say he was from? <laughs> Booney, Texas? No, back in the boonies. Back in the boonies. <laughs> okay. Montgomery, Texas. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Or back home, right? Yes, sir, a little bit past the uh, we like to say the Twain, uh, I guess Willis and uh, Tom Ball area. Magnolia. Magnolia. There you go. All right. All right. All right. Well, PJ will say where you're playing next. We're at the Urban Cowgirl Saloon and Dance Hall in uh, Magnolia, Texas, off 1488, next Saturday night. It's going to be our last show of the year for the band. Uh, with my the drummer I have now, he's my cousin actually, he's moving to Phoenix, Arizona. And then we have a show with uh, Clay Walker next month. Oh. And in Houston, huh? Yes, sir. At the new uh, Stampede. Stampede. Off the 59 number. It's a pretty huge place. It's uh, yeah. Lee Harness is uh, doing all that. He's a great guy. I like one of my great people. As you the, old, the old Tumbleweed Texas guy. Yes, sir. Yep. Yes, sir. Yep. yep. That's where I got to see you. Well, when you said when you said Urban Cowgirls, BJ really, his ears perked up. Did you see that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah. There you go. There you go. Anyway, uh, let's welcome here Mr. Stephen Sweden. Let's go walk through the storm with you. Hope you like it. This little building sure has changed It even has a different name Ain't no longer sell barbecue 
All they got now is Mexican food and this same old booze in the same old place. Well, I first sit with you that day and I walk to my truck after they close. But find your name and number on my window, how the time flies and how faith has a hand. Girl, you were a girl I knew Now you're wearing my wedding band As the sky cries You got a man to hold on to But I will walk through the storms With you There's been a lot of storms, haven't there? Every man, there's a good woman. Behind every woman, there's a strong love. Two strong hearts keeping it together. Walking hand in hand to the end of forever. So I give you your ring and I'll take mine. We'll walk hand in hand to the end of time. And in 20 years, it'll be the same. Rocking chairs and hearing us sing how time flies and how big. Thank you so much, guys. <laughs> Stephen Sweden, hey, we got that on video. Is that going to be your next single? Yes, the sir. last song you just did? Yes, sir. It should be oh, out. Uh, wow. February to March. Okay, and you get it on iTunes or? Yes, sir. Yeah, oh, you wow. get it on Google Play. Uh, Google Play. Amazon. Amazon.com. Amazon. Amazon. Yeah. That is a oh, we just go all weather. He might have it over there. I don't know. <laughs> he's, he's got a recording device on him, I think. Yeah, there he is. Right. Yeah, there he is. He recorded it, man. Anyway. They played at do -si do last night over in the Woodlands. And uh, they called Eddie up and said, hey, do you mind if we come back to Livingston, Texas? And Eddie goes, well, yeah. And at the... Oh, he's got to sign Eddie's guitar before he leaves. He took it all over the country with him and played a lot of shows. He's got to sign Eddie's guitar before he leaves, so make sure he does that. Um, let's see what else. Uh, I got to thank my buddies at Holiday Inn Express, uh, the good guys, because they help do what we do here and put our guys up when they stay here. So I got to thank my Holiday Inn Express guys uh, over in Baskin Square. All weather, more auto sales, uh, they, they pitched in. My buddy Phil Smith, Burton Properties, Smith Properties, what could do it without those guys. And uh, if you want to buy a land house or just you know, build money, just feel free to do it. <laughs> yes, or take it. She looks not her head, yeah. Yeah, bring it on. Bring it on, baby. Uh, I got to thank Angel. She's on the camera. And then brother Kevin, yep, they're on the camera. So, uh, we're going to put this on Strike TV, and then we'll put it on striketv.com so you'll be able to check it out and do things like that. And we'll put it on... Uh, now, Eddie's got a, a website, too. Uh, the Courthouse... What's the stop? Dot com? Courthousewhistlestop.com. He's got a Facebook. We all have Facebook, so. And then Miss Carol, I tell you what, Carol and Joe, they are always taking pictures, and they got a big Facebook all around Texas. Is, it, is that what it's called? Okay. And uh, sure, check it out on that. Tons of pictures. So you want to come on up? And let's bring to the stage David Ball and the Pioneer Playboy. How many here watches uh, the, the, the TV series Nashville? Nobody. 
Anybody watch it around here? Nashville? Nobody. Nashville. Nobody. 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 No, 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 it's a brand new series. It's a brand new TV series. They watch it, they just don't want to admit it. Uh, I admit it. You admit it? Okay. Anyway, Scott Scott is actually on the, the new Nashville series. He's, he's the drummer in the back, or on the big stage right. One of them. Yeah. yeah. And uh, I got to say my new win. Yeah. David Ball is in the house. Right here, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, baby. Right here. It's a guitar. Hey, and Scott, hey, uh, this guy here, Troy. Troy he, Cook. Troy Cook. Troy, Troy Cook, Troy Cook Jr. He's got a song, and I, Lazy American. Be careful now. Drink well, I, I got to do this. Yeah. This guy, David, surrounds himself with talented people. Look who's sitting next to him here. <laughs> they didn't get that. <laughs> they would not go back, way back. 1993, I get a I get a call, and they got a guy at Greenway Plaza sitting on top, him and his band, sitting on top of a Winnebago at the radio station, blasting the radio station yeah. with a song. Yes. And so we take our news crew down there with ABC, uh, Channel 13 at the time. Right. And David was on the Winnebago trying to get attention. What better way? Saying and thinking problems. Yeah. Naked. No, he wasn't. Uh, but I thought, this, this is pretty cool. He got, he got some attention that day, got some news. Well, that wasn't my, that was the genius record. Was, uh, but anyway, he, he, and it, it worked too, did it? Sort of. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> uh, anyway, uh, but we've been following him around. He's allowed us to follow him around, and, and I'm glad he's, he's a dear friend. The, the, uh, Billy and, and Scott and Troy, all, they, they all treat us like family. And uh, Billy Paris down there from Florida. Yep, let's give him a hand. Billy Paris on the bass. And uh, I'm just glad he's here at the Courthouse Whistle Stop Cafe. Thanks for making that phone call. Well, thank you, Thomas Mauser. You know, I always remember Tom. He's the guy we played somewhere like close to Houston, and we go into this little place, and uh, oh, I think they had about 32 people there. Oh, and, no, no, no. No, I'm not talking about you. Oh. <laughs> uh, and then we go about 60 miles up the road, and Tom Mauser had about 850 people waiting to hear us. Uh, some some kind of... Reno's and check. Well, this was a... Are you fighting going on? No, there no. <laughs> no, it was. It's a church now. You <laughs> church <laughs> yeah. For the better. They call that Jesus place needed. Yeah. My wife never. She never comes with me, but for some reason she wound up with us at, at Reno's, yeah, and uh, it was a wild night. So yeah, she thinks every night I'm out there. It's like. Uh, Big party. Yeah. I tell her. I tell her no. It's <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the stage, David Ball. All right, thank you, Tommy. That's a fine promoter there. I think Angela's the, the brains of the album. I certainly hope. Does that make you look cute? Shake the, not the camera, but I think Angela's the brains of the album. And the beauty. Yeah, so definitely the beauty. Well, what you guys, uh, it's good to be here. Really, really great. We've been on the tooling around all over the state playing the big city so it's very nice to be here we had a great meal Eddie uh, that was a little too much but we'll, we'll see what we can do that's his usual we need a shot of Eddie over there he's usually counting the money <laughs> no you know, people lose money on us we should have told you that before we booked <laughs> Don't break my heart 
a CD I did a few years back I had riding with Private Malone on and I was moving to Texas and I was going to do a whole complete, I spent a lot of time in Texas, lived down in around Austin for about 11 years and uh, then up in Nashville for about, uh, oh about 10 years I was living up there and, uh, and really you know, maybe two and a half years, it was pretty good. I really enjoyed it. It was a different lot of trees, and uh, <laughs> and then there was a lot of snakes, and uh, chiggers, uh, but it's a pretty place. We like it up there, and uh, so this is a title from this record, and we didn't know we had a hit record on our hands at, at the time, so I wound up playing all of it, the <coughs> Northern regions with old riding with Private Malone, but uh, this is Amigo, one of my favorite tunes on here. Troy featuring Troy Cook on the beautiful uh, red. It's red guitar. Part of it, it's red. I heard somebody told me that you paid nine thousand dollars for that guitar. No. Okay. <laughs> I wasn't too, but he makes it sound like nine thousand dollars. <laughs> One, two, three, four, one.
Yeah, that night I was right 